Good morning, dear friends. Now we are going to discuss the questions related to the topic admission of a partner. Now, first of all, all the videos which we have prepared, questions I have taken from the T. S. Grewal books. All the question we have solved from the T. S. Grewal book. Some questions which we have taken from the D. K. Grewal book. So where I have already explained in the video, these questions I have taken from the D K Goel books. Clear? But be careful. All the questions concerned video I have prepared from the book of T S Grewal, which is prescribed by the school. Now come on. here. First of all, in the admission question number eight, I have taken. See here. Under this question, there are two partners, Kabir and Farid, and their profit sharing ratio seven is to three. Kabir surrendered two by ten from his share, and Farid one by ten from his share in favor of Jyoti. Kabir surrendered two by ten of his share, and Farid surrendered one by ten of his share to the interest of Jyoti. Now Jyoti share two by ten plus one by ten from no need to multiply. It will be three by ten Jyoti share. So Kabir new share earlier seven by ten. After sacrificing two by ten to the interest of Jyoti, Kabir share will come five by ten. And after contributing one by ten to the Jyoti by Farid, Farid new share will be. By ten minus one by ten, it will be two by ten. So new P A has a new profit sharing ratio between the Jyoti, Kabir, and Farid will come five by ten of the Kabir's, two by ten of the Jyoti, three by ten of the two by ten of the Farid, three by ten of the Jyoti. That is the five is to two is to three. And sacrifice made by Kabir to buy tenth to the interest of Jyoti understood or not? And one by tenth by Farid. So sacrifice made by Kabir and Farid to buy tenth is to one by ten that is two is two. So here we have got the new profit sharing ratio as well as sacrificing. This question is completed. After this, now next question I have selected question number forty. This question is concerned about the hidden goodwill. Now here is the question forty. Come to the point. But in the question forty, Bina and Naman are partners. Their profit sharing ratio four is to one. Their capital sum is ninety thousand and seventy thousand. And but a Pratik admitted for one by third share in the profit and brings one lakh as capital. So Pratik admitted for one by ten share of profit and brings capital for one by third share of one lakh. Here total capital of the firm on the basis of Pratik's share and capital. One lakh into three by one, it will get three lakh. Total capital of the firm, because Pratik admitted for one by third share for one lakh. Now on one by third he brings one lakh. So what should be the total capital of the firm on the basis of Pratik's share and capital? That is the three lakhs. While present capital of the firm ninety thousand of the and seventy of the existing partner. That is the Vina and Naman and one lakh capital. So total capital of the firm is now two lakh sixty thousand in the present scenario. So hidden total is equal to total capital of the firm minus present total capital. That is the forty thousand. So hidden total is equal of the firm is now forty thousand. Because in this question we already asked here, find out the hidden total of the firm. After this, now I am taking question number fifty-one. That is concerned the revaluation part. Because when a partner is admitting certain value of assets in P 
these are decreed certain assets and liabilities taken over were taken over by the partners. In this regard, how to pass the general entries? Now see. In the question number 51, there are two partners X and Y. Profit selling ratio 3 is to 2. X and Y profit selling ratio 3 is to X and Y. Their profit selling ratio is 3 is to 2. That is the old partner, their profit selling ratio 3 is to 2. Now it is Z admitted for 1 by 4 sale. And at the time of admission of Z, investment appeared in the books 80,000. Half of the investment to be taken over by X and Y in their profit selling ratio at book value. So investment present or appears in the books 80,000. Half investment of the book value taken over by X and Y. So X receiver, X will be debited, Y will be debited, X capital account debit, Y is capital account debit. They are taking over investment is going out from the firm, that's why investment will be printed. Now the 40,000, it will take over by old partners in old profit selling ratio, it will come 24,000 and 16,000. And remaining investment now value 50,000, it is clearly mentioned here. Remaining investment were valued at 50,000 plus general entry. Out of 80, 40,000 investment taken over by X and Y, and rest of the half investment, 40,000, will take over the value now, 50,000. The value of investment increased, so investment account debit to revaluation account 10,000. It is concerned about the investment taken over or in assets increase and decrease. So this is the question number 8, this is the question number 40 and this is the question number 51.